And the blink and all of that? Damn. Oh! Okay! Today we're checking out the new episode of Oshinoko, but first, if you enjoyed the video, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. That way you can help us reach 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year. We're very close. We're like 9K away. Less than that. Almost 8K away. Make that 7K by tomorrow. Probably not. Anyways, listen, you can find the full link as well as exclusives over on Patreon. Plus, you'll find some other links down in the description. If you like non-anime reactions, I do that on a separate channel. There's a lot of K-dramas on that channel. So if you like K-dramas, go check that out. And stop by the live streams over on Twitch so you can be like these people right here. Blooded in the chat saying things like, Hi, YouTube. Join the stream for cringe. Very cringe stream, not gonna lie. You could be like them. You can literally stop by, hang out with us as we watch Oshinoko on Wednesdays or as we watch a bunch of different anime on a bunch of different days. Stop by one of the streams. Let's have some fun together. That sounds a little weird. Let's watch anime. Okay, let's watch this anime. All right, cool. <laughs> Woo! Yo! Oh, they're introducing everyone? Hey! This shit high though! Yo, that's so sick! And they got the spotlight on them? Oh! That's so fucking cool, dude! Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Fuck this kid. We hate this kid. We hate this kid, right? This is the kid we hate, right, chat? I don't remember what the one we hate plays. This is the one we hate, right? Yes? Yeah? This is the one we hate? Fuck this kid. Yo, Aqua looks so cool, though. Sheesh. I like that Aqua's color is like an Aqua color, right? His color is kind of like an Aqua is, you know what I'm saying? I like that, dude. I like that his color is like kind of Aqua. Tokyo Blade. Oh, this is kind of cool. Oh, shit. Yo, we start off with a fight. This is hype. What the fuck? Yo. Yo, she's crazy in this shit. Oh, yes. The one acknowledged as strongest by all of the Oath Swords will take possession of the country. Gain the power of nation season. Her, yo, again, her blades are just the coolest. It's got the little hearts in it and shit. It just looks so sick. Yo, Doga Koba! Doga Kobo going crazy! Oh. Okay, well, that was quickly... Oh, okay, well, that was quickly... Uh... <laughs> I like that, dude. She's doing a good job. She's a good actor. Oh, no. What is this futuristic-ass setting? Wait, hold on. What the fuck? Oh. He got a harem or something? What is this? <laughs> Yo! Hey! Our boy can act now! He did a pretty good job! That's cool, dude. It's just a cool-ass setting and stuff. I like this. Okay, okay, okay. This is the queen side. This is high, dude. Bro, I kind of want to watch a play like this. This looks cool. This looks really cool. Oh. Don't let him outshine you, dog. Don't let him outshine you. Don't let him do it. Don't let him outshine you. Oh, dude, he crazy. Oh, so he's he's trying to get theater to be more uh I don't know popular I guess. He believes in him. Oh, never mind. 
Oh shit, never mind. His who worked. Oh. Is this his sword? The one that's all torn up, bro? He's been practicing a lot. Yo. Let's go, dude. Yo, he's been grinding. He's been working at it. She don't like him, but she's going to recognize that he's getting better. What the fuck? Isn't that 7th, 8th, ninth grade? So when he was in 7th grade, a ninth grade? Damn! What the fuck? Had her way with you is kind of crazy. Oh, so he's just an Ikemen. And so he didn't even realize that he was growing into an Ikemen. Yeah, he's just a good looking guy. And so things just come easy to him. Come on, dude. Come on, bro. Please. Please, 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 turn up. The first step is recognition. Recognizing that you sucked. You can't get good unless you realize you were bad. So the fact that he just recognizes he was bad means that he can now get better. Oh. Come on! Come on! Turn up when it matters, right? Turn up when it matters. I like this shit. Turn up when it matters, your key moment. Then people will recognize you're not completely talented. Or, uh, sorry, you're not completely talentless. They will see a spark. All it takes is a spark for people to say, oh, he could be good. He, he could be great. That one moment could define your whole performance. Oh, shit! Yo! Yo! What the fuck? What the fuck did he do? Bro, that is a, a blade. What? God damn! <laughs> what did he just do? He just spun that shit like a nunchuck. Come on. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I'll be real with you. That wasn't really acting, right? Uh, he just did a stunt, kind of. When you think about it, right? He did some like fucking uh. Backflip, somersault, and then he twirled the, the sword around. Can you do it? No, no, no. I'm not saying it's not impressive. I do think it's impressive. But people, his issue is that he doesn't think he's a good actor. You know, what makes you a good actor is carrying the emotional weight of a scene, right? I mean, it's cool as fuck what he did. Yes, it's a great stunt, but it's not an acting moment. So I still hope that there is an acting moment to come. He did the cool stunt. That's dope as fuck. People are going to look at him like, oh, he's not completely incapable, right? He can do a cool stunt at least. So if he can now follow that up with that emotional moment and draw everyone's attention to him in a good way, then I think it's worth it, right? He nails the, the flip and now he's just got to act it. <laughs> Come on. Come on, 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 come on. Acting. Yes, 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 yes. It's time. So she, this is going to help him too right here. She's seeing how Akane is trying to get in the mindset of the character, trying to understand the motives, right? Try to understand the character themselves. And, and, and if he can do that same thing, 
and really embody the character, that'll be good acting. And that's what I'm hoping. That's what I'm hoping happens here. So he's trying to take he okay, so he recognizes he's not gonna be at the level of like Akane, right? But he can at least see what she's doing and try. So he's gonna try to understand his character a little bit. And I'm again, I'm just hoping after all his backflips, all of his stunts, he actually like, you know, you know what I'm saying? He actually like embodies the character. I want him to fucking, I want him to stand in front of green hair, pull his nuts out of his pants, drop him to the floor. Big nuts. Huh, what? Not literally. He's a kid, bro. I'm not saying actually pull your nuts out. I, it's a metaphor, chat. It's a metaphor, bro. A simile. It's an analogy. Something like that. It's one of those words. All right, it's a metaphor. Here he goes. Ooh. Oh my god, dude. You can see every fucking eyelash. Yo, Doga Kobo, though. Look at the art here and the blink and all of that. Damn. Oh, shit. Okay. What the fuck? <laughs> is he unlocking? Is he unlocking his star? Dude, this is amazing. This is so beautiful. Oh my god. Holy shit. Yo, they are flexing right now. This animation is crazy! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, his character loses? Made you break character, bitch! Now he broke character! Yo, you seen how shocked his face was? He, he broke character a little bit just now. He's like, damn, did a good job. Oh, wait, I'm still acting. Oh, shit. That's my fucking guy right there. And now he respects him. You are still an asshole and we still don't like you, but the fact that you respect him makes you a little bit likable. Okay, so now I don't absolutely hate this guy anymore. The fact that he can, the fact that he can see somebody put on a performance, see them be capable and respect them afterwards. I got respect for him now. I like him. I like him now. He's good. Ish. No, no, I mean, he's okay. He's okay with me now. Oh my God. Ew. Yes. Aqua, dude. So cute. Oh my God. Growth. Let's go. Hey, that was a good ass episode, dude. That was a good ass fucking episode, dude. That was a good episode. Hey, for once, I'm not even mad about the ending. I'm not about, I'm not mad about us leaving, like leaving off on a cliffhanger, not knowing what's, you know what I'm saying? Like, how dare you? No, none of that. That was a good ending. I like that. That was good. Peak. Absolute peak, dude. I love Oshinoko. It's just too good. That was phenomenal. That was, that was phenomenal. I love it. I love that we got an episode focused around, uh, again, like just like you mentioned, chat, focused around a character that's not as, like, we don't give a shit as much about him as everybody else, right? We don't really care compared to, like, Aqua, compared to Akane, compared to Kana, you know what I'm saying? Uh, compared to these other characters. And, dog, this episode, this episode could have been, I mean, if it wasn't for the fact that Akane, like, found out everything, like, the whole kid thing, like... That shit was insane. Outside of that moment, this might have been the best uh, episode we've gotten for this season. It was such a good episode. I love that we focused on him and got to see him shine and got to see him earn the respect of the green haired dude. That was incredible. Um, what did you guys think about this one? Let me know down in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, don't just leave a comment. Also like and subscribe. Until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.